Um, his buying your ticket girl, yes. Is that wrong? So Bree's using those screenshots of like what? Like this girl is crashing out and she's harassing me. And if she thinks that like I'm not doing anything about it, she's insane. Sending you prayer, Celeste. And I literally just called that guy and I was like, I wasn't begging you to buy my ticket, right? And he was like, no. And then I was like, I'm sorry, I was just frustrated, you know? And he was like, yeah, I know. He was like, it's fine. She's literally bringing people into this that have nothing to do with anything. It's so crazy to me. <laughs> like, bro. Like, I... She's just showing more and more how much I bother her and like, you know? Imagine letting me bother you that much. Thank you, Haley. Yeah, I'll leave it to the lawyers. It was so funny because um, a bunch of my friends, like that when I had that party where Brie was being super racist, they all responded to my story and they were like, is that that racist girl? <laughs> and I was like, yeah. They were like, is that that girl that we kicked out of that party? And I was like, yeah, it was actually literally all of them were like is that that girl that we kicked out and then one of them sent me a video of them kicking her out <laughs> like bro you're crashing out that bad is crazy you're not gonna get me to crash out girl you can keep trying you literally literally brie has done probably what two or three things that are illegal I asked for my stuff back and her friend blocked my number. So, great. You're crashing out right now. If this is crashing out, what is she doing? If I'm crashing out right now, what is she, what is she doing? Have you ever tried caviar? Yeah. The cops could get it back. Yeah, I know. Don't worry, guys. At least you look good. Thank you. Don't worry, guys. Lisa, thank you. Get the police involved. Oh, I have lawyer, a lawyer involved. I have more than just the police. Trust me, guys. You're pretty. Thank you. Cat mom, thank you. Why did I stop being friends with Bree for so many reasons? that I've already addressed like 15,000 times. Thank you, Aubrey. <laughs> Am I okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just tired. You're so pretty, thank you. You're stunning, thank you guys. I love you guys. Today, she said that I can't afford a lawyer. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're right, I can't. Love you, Sonia. I love you guys so much. It's the same person on welfare saying that. Nothing wrong with welfare, but... I 
I love you guys, Nikki. I love you guys. Yes, chat, I'm sorry. Brie um, sent a tea page, me asking a guy, or me telling a guy that the bare minimum was buying my ticket somewhere. That's my bad. I'm sorry for having standards. If a guy's telling me to fly to him, a guy that likes me, a guy that has known me for years, I think maybe he should buy the ticket. Maybe. I don't know if that's something that my supporters are gonna think differently of me, but it's just a bare minimum. I don't think about money like that, I'm sorry. Really, money isn't my first thing with a guy. Um, maybe when I hung out with Brie a little bit, she put that in my head, but um, no, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm not flying to a guy unless he's buying the ticket. Especially, like, if he supposedly likes me and stuff like that. I guess that is me begging for someone to buy me a ticket. I don't really know. I love you too, Crystal. Me, it was just, like, I would always make jokes with Bree, like, if, like, a bunch of guys would want me to come back to Miami, where I live, but I would be like, okay, then buy me my ticket if you want me to come back. because I didn't really want to go back to Miami, but I was like, I mean, I'll go home if you buy my ticket. I did not say anything about her baby, no. I don't talk about her baby in any negative context at all. If that's all it takes, I'll buy a ticket to Vegas in a hotel. No, that's not all it takes, buddy. <laughs> that's not, listen, I'm not getting flown out like that, all right? I'm not that kind of girl. Why would she send that to a T page that's not even embarrassing? I don't know. She's literally not gonna stop, guys. Like, I don't really know what to say. Like, I could post so much. She's trying to get under my skin. Thank you for the roses. Do you guys think I should, do you guys think my hair is greasy right now, right? I should wash it. I'm about to wash it. Yeah, it is greasy at the top. I'm gonna get off live in a little bit. Did I leak the cuddle text? Yeah, but I posted that on my podcast account. And then I like quickly deleted it, but people already have it, so I just reposted it, to be honest. I mean, I, yeah, I guess, like, <sighs> I don't know, chat. I guess I did, you know, spend all my money in L.A. buying someone food two to three times a day, every day, for two to three months. Yeah. Yeah, and, and diapers and everything too. Anyways, I love you guys. I love you, Britt. I hope you guys liked the card pulls earlier. I love you guys too. How much do you need for a lawyer? I can help. I promise I don't need money from you guys. I love you guys so much. And I appreciate you guys, but no. I can. I'm fine. Don't worry. <laughs> Thank you for the heart puffs. I don't know. I think she's just mad at who I'm friends with and everything. Um, she's more upset like about me than she is anything else. I've never met someone so obsessed with me in my life. But to be honest with you guys, I knew this was going to happen after I testified. Um, I've been known. Uh, why she said y'all weren't friends. I know, she said that we were never friends and she said that um, she was using me and everything. 
So, I guess I'm gonna get harassed, you know, until, yeah, I did, Nikki. Thank you, KV. What did I say in court? I don't think. I don't think I need, it's appropriate for me to sit here and say everything that I said in court, but um, didn't you say that you're done talking about everything and responding? Um, she's like nonstop though, guys. Like, I thought that maybe this would put an end to it is me saying my piece, but she literally won't stop. Um, no, you didn't make me shut up. And... Now, Brianna Olsen, you have met your match. I just want to let you know that. You have quite literally met your match. So, I'm calm right now. But, homegirl, I am your karma. And I hope you know that. Be so for real. She's saying, I did not lie in court, guys. I did not lie in court. I did not ask for the video of the fight to be shown in court either. Um, like, do you get, I don't know if you guys know how it works in court and you get asked questions and a bunch of different stuff. Anything I got asked was out of my hands, so. <clears throat> No, she did not show the video in court, but she's telling people that I asked for them to show the video of us fighting in court. No, I did not. Like, this girl is like... I've never met someone so envious of me and so overly obsessed with me. It's insane. I just did the right thing. I am handling things, guys, don't worry. Outside of social media, I'm handling things, but I don't need to talk about it, like, in depth. Sounds like you're both obsessed with each other. The girl has posted about me probably five or six times within the last 24, 24 hours. She reposted a video of me and Julian arguing. She posted a video about me, by the way, lying saying julian this and that she's lying um posted about the baby um what was it? there was some there was another story that she posted saying that i use chat G gbt um what else guys uh no i don't get lashes every few days Th those are just drafts and i have a lash fill tomorrow those videos are from like two, three weeks ago, probably. Shit, I have 1% chat. I'm gonna get off live and get back on. Is this too easy for me, bro? Bro, over here, bro. <laughs>